Hello, dear friends. Monday overloaded with information. This is a very condensed summary. Opinion piece. Catharsis. Paving the way. This is unpredictable. Process of liberation. Discharge of toxicity. Everything takes time, but it will come suddenly. After Banner push. Simon Pax says it has started. Police search in the European Parliament. Let's start. Catharsis is an inner purification, release or transformation brought about by a profound life experience, but it is also defined as the purifying and liberating effect that tragedy has on spectators, arousing compassion, horror, and other emotions. In biology, it is the spontaneous or provoked expulsion of harmful substances from the organism, and among the ancient Greeks, it was the ritual purification of persons or things affected by some impurity. Catharsis means purification, cleansing, purging, or emotional discharge. It is the purification and purging of emotions through dramatic art, or it can be any extreme emotional state that results in renewal and restoration. As a metaphor, it is a way described in Aristotle's Poetics to refer to the effects of tragedy on the minds of the spectators, producing emotional, bodily, mental and spiritual purification. Through the experience of pity and way and ewi, spectators of tragedy would experience the purification of the soul from these passions. In psychology, the term is associated with the Freudian psychoanalysis and relates specifically to the expression of repressed trauma, bringing it, bringing it into consciousness and thus permanently releasing it. Social catharsis can be seen as the collective expression of extreme emotion when groups of people gather together, as in the case of large crowds at sporting events. Download. All darkness must be brought to the surface before the light can officially manifest. People must be told the truth slowly so that they can digest information. This is the truth that the impatient do not like to hear. But everything takes time, no matter how much we want to run. According to Simon Pax, this has started gently, so it doesn't seem alarming. The times are too serious, the challenge too urgent, and the stakes too high to indulge the usual passions of political debate, writes GFK Jr. We are not here to curse the darkness, but to light a candle that can guide us through that darkness to a safe and sane future. Puffness said, in quotes, After Barna is underway, its papa is to provide a temporary increase in thrust on takeoff. All stops are being reducted, curtains opened, carpets swept and walls scrabbled. Yes, scrubbed. None of you have a clean environment to work in, and the environment is worse than it has been in years. Most are not sure what people think and what they will really stand for. The darkness has to surface before the light can win. Wait for the next shoe to drop. It's much closer. Be assured that the show will come to an end. Take a step back. Be objective. Drive in a straight line towards your goal and stay away from politicking. One day, everyone will realize that this is a very exciting time to be on the planet and stay the course. It will be worth it. December. The year is coming to an end and I'm sure there is no need to summarize it here. 
as you are all experiencing it firsthand in daily life. Chaos impacts in very different ways, depending on one's personal situation. The important thing is that one learns to adapt ways and means to survive through it all. And this is not a one-size-fits-all approach. Regardless of how you make your way, I hope you are achieving your goals despite the current malaise. The global deals are going to be the largest financial transactions in history. They are designed to achieve the ethical infusion of off-balance sheet Asian dynastic wealth into global economies, but subject to strict oversight and management by a central team of trustees. Surprise! According to Nagari, the time has come to open your arms to receive. Be surprised by life, for the time has come to reap for so many lost years, to struggle every day for a piece of bread. Abundance will come to all, mainly to those who have persevered and reached the goal. I am sorry to say that for the sleepers, things will not be so easy, for they focus on the negative and will no longer be able to live in the high frequency of Gaia. They will not be left to fend for themselves by any means, but you can no longer live in the high frequency of Earth. They will go where the vibrational frequency takes them. There you can start over, learn and do the inner work that you did not do in this lifetime. The darkness is being removed from Gaia. Those who wanted to extinguish humankind are now being persecuted. The Golden Age comes from the 1212 portal. This year we are ahead of Christmas. Embrace it and all the gifts that come to them. Open your heart above all to receive them. And don't forget to share your gifts. Be grateful and know in your heart that all that is yours belongs to you and returns to each of you multiplied. Paving the way. Paving the way for 2023 by Patricia Diana Cota Robles. This month of December, we are given the opportunity to set the stage for the miracles that the light workers will be called upon to co-create in collaboration with the Company of, Hef of Heaven. This month, the Company of Heaven will guide us step by step through various light activities. The epic purge that was achieved through the unified efforts of Heaven and Earth during the 14 days from 11th November to the solstice on 20th December 2021 is responsible for dismantling the matrices of obsolete paradigms and the myriad social structures that have manipulated, controlled and repressed the masses of humankind for eons of time. These matrices have been held in place through the fear-based consciousness of separation and duality. That distorted level of consciousness manifests through the behavioral patterns of greed, corruption, abuse of power, hatred, ignorance, and the willingness to respond with violence. All of these behaviors are void of love. That patching was a critical factor in paving the way for the next vitally important events that the awakening of humankind and the company of heaven were inspired to, to co-create in 2022. There are several powerful activities of light that have been accomplished so far this year. These events include the co-creation of the Divine Matrix for a generational changing of the God, the full opening of the portal of the Divine Holy Breath, and events that brought into balance the higher aspect of the Divine Masculine and Feminine in everyone's heart flame. As we make final preparations this month for the birth of the new year 2023 and the activities of light that will be called to co-create during that year of light transformation, the Company of Heaven has shared information to help each of us truly understand the magnitude of what it means now 
that the divine feminine has at the last been fully balanced with the divine masculine in the heart flame of every being. It, it would happen all of a sudden. Stefan's opinion. The 3D world still has, a, has us bound and that may not be as bad as you think. You can't make highly indoctrinated people abandon the 3D way of thinking 100% from one second to the next. I don't know anyone who has. And if there is one thing I don't like, it's the super didactic behavior. You must or you must not. I do, I do my development the way I want. Everyone does their individual development the way they want. That's how awakening happens, not suddenly and, expect, and unexpectedly. All my own speed, at my own speed, according to the plan of the soul. I leave the development of each one to his personal reason. I believe that on the outside it is just the show that is controlled by the equation. There is a script and it has been worked out to the point where the, there are only lower level levels with puppets. They haven't given orders for, to them for years, so they continue with the latest outdated instructions until they are suddenly and unexpectedly stopped. The script also foresees that the new world is prepared with the repair of the old one and the destruction of what we don't need. We see it if we, if we want to see it from the perspective of the eagle with a good panoramic view, but many only see what they want to see. In the financial area, it is quite obvious that massive work has been done on the possibilities of establishing an absolutely safe, simple and global monetary system for all beings, and it would be activated suddenly and unexpectedly. It would start the revaluation immediately, and it would work in a totally different way than what we have had or read so far from all sources. The signs and indications are there, even in the official media, if you can read between the lines. We can think big right now, not about our personal wealth, but only about the future of all of us. It is out there, almost before our eyes, and suddenly and unexpectedly, the day will come when everything will be presented to us. This is unpredictable. The key figure in this issue would be Elon Musk. You can think what you want about him and his questionable past, but he is currently collaborating with the coalition and implementing a declassification program. Reset News Our countries will have a level playing field in trade as all world currencies level out, which could go up early next year due to go backing. On 8th December, the value of the Iraqi dinar was said to be floating on Forex as part of its revaluation. That float could only be seen on the back screens of the banks. Everyone has a very secure quantum financial account in the QFS system. You can access your account and make a transition from anywhere at any time. Timelines prove a transaction along with loss, codes, orders, statutes, optics and communications. The banking meltdown would explode, would expose the global cryptocurrency money laundering system across all countries. A cryptocurrency corruption scandal would ensue with the collapse of a major bank and hundreds of smaller banks. The Fed wants to control of digital currency and will try to hide the exposure of money laundering schemes. Bruce expects the dollar to be asset backed by the end of January 2023. Supply crisis. The European Union 
wants of a possible shortage of 30 billion cubic meters of gas by 2023. Germany orders farms to stop operating, while the Davos Forum calls for an end to farming. The Dutch state threatens to take over 3,000 3, farms. Journalist Alina Lip believes the German government is likely to announce legislative changes to crack down on opponents and restrict free speech. Belgian police search the European Parliament's headquarters in Brussels over the corruption scandal. Davos Forum activists got destroying power plants in the US. Dog it dog. Dog it dog and the witch hunt is a destruction to avoid exposure of money laundering connected to cryptocurrencies. As the collapse occurs, European Union countries would continue to blame each other, which with this would come major intelligent leaks from various agencies to back up their countries. Brazil would be an example of what would happen around the world. The Brazilian people is in protest for more than 40 days. Julian Assange, through Wikileaks, would have information that could lead to the downfall of 98% of the world's governments. According to Steve Biko, public international tribunals would be scheduled for mid-2023. As many have said, the world is now suffering what Russia experienced in the 1991 crash. But after the storm, it will grow rapidly towards a better society that most would never have believed possible. According to Gold Deluxe, banks are preparing to activate the new financial system backed by precious metals. Banks are being audited to show proof of assets to pack transactions. When this is complete, the implementation of an international payment system will come into play. The underground facilities are very real and are part of a global network that has used the dark side to get its way. The coalition is in the process of destroying their tunnels, so they have now nowhere, n- n- no nowhere to go but above ground. The holy grail of unlimited energy. Scientists at Lawrence Le- Livermore Federal National Laboratory in California has achieved a historic breakthrough in nuclear fusion, according to the Financial Times. Where is this shortage? Declassification. A cryptocurrency scandal is expected to trigger a meltdown. Elon Musk is also expected to buy Apple at a lower price in 2024 after the exposure. Trickle down would open the fruit gate that would drain the global swamp. Elon Musk wants that if the Fed were to raise rates, it would be to blame for the economic meltdown. The release of Twitter at archives would just be a warm-up process. The Davos Forum is moving forward with its plan, but it would be counterproductive. Twitter archives are being released and the public is starting to see the infiltration. People must be told the truth slowly, so they can digest information. Once the public digests the information, the other facts will be released with documents. The dark side feels pain every step of the way. The panic is real and they could try to shut down communications, but this wouldn't work and nothing can stop it. Testimony from an FBI agent implicates his bosses in censoring social media. According to Fox News Carlson, the second part of the Twitter archives confirms that the company was shadow banning critics of the blockade. Plan B for According to Captain, 99% of the time we don't need a plan B, but when we least expect it, 
we may need a backup. If you keep an eye on the global geopolitical scene, you may have heard rumors that Elon Musk has been exposing subtle meddling and suppression of posts on Twitter since his patches of the social media platform. According to Juan Osabin, the Insurrection Act was not signed to avoid civil conflict. The judges who sought justice are under attack and they need to know what they are on the right path and that the village is be and that the people is behind them. It is safer to send letters than to physically appear anywhere, as the demons are disparate. The pain is mightier than the sweat. According to Sherry, Jesus would return to lock up all the demons and recreate a garden of Eden on earth without demons. Isaiah says that the nature of animals would be changed so that everything would be friendly. Children will be able to put their hand in the snake pit and not be harmed. Sounds good. That is all for today. Thanks a lot, dear friends.